Okay, you're listening to a special Halloween stories edition of the Ricky Sims Show on 103.7 Gator FM. <laughs> Are you scared yet? I am. Not because of Halloween ghosts, though. I don't even believe in them. Our topic tonight is the boogeyman himself, Michael Myers. No introduction necessary here, folks. Now we have a few people who would like to share their Myers-related stories. Some have even claimed to have seen Myers in the flesh. <laughs> Was that before or after you puffed on your crack pipe? <laughs> Give me a break, first caller. Hey Ricky, I love your show. Just a few things I want to clear up. Michael Myers is long dead. There is no boogeyman. And shows like this don't really help to support that fact. You're bringing the dead back to life by talking bullshit about a maniac who's been dead for years. And what's even worse is you're inviting other losers to talk their bullshit about this Haddonfield psycho. The whole thing is utter horse shit. You should just leave it dead and buried where it belongs and get on and celebrate Halloween with some beers. Okay, okay, enough. Don't tell me how to run my show. I'll do whatever I like because it's my show. On to the next caller, please. Hey, Ricky. I just wanted to say this whole Michael Myers story would make a great movie. I mean, with all those conspiracies they have about government and satanic cults, somebody's got to be writing a script somewhere. I mean, think about how much money Hollywood would make out of this. People would cream over a movie about a killer, but when it's real and it's happened right on our doorstep, well, it's got to be better than any bullshit true movies people are showing right now, huh? Oh, and do I get to play the DJ who gets killed for talking trash about old Mikey? No, thank you. Hollywood could kiss my curvy butt any day. Next caller. Fuck Michael Myers, man. I mean, he would have shown up by now. You people suck. You got no brains to start. And as for this Howard Stern wannabe DJ, I could do a better show talking out of my asshole. But you seem to manage that just fine, Rick. Uh, thanks, but no thanks. Jeez, what a loser. Okay, now we're talking to a guy who claims that Michael Myers is alive and preparing to return to Haddonfield. Uh, and again, people, I ask, can I have some of that crack you smoking? Take it away, pal. I've seen him. When I was a baby, he tried to kill me. He's out there right now, and he's not gonna just go away. True. Evil never dies, it just waits and waits. I'll be a victim too if I don't do something. People will die. And it won't be the first time, we'll know that. Michael Myers is coming back, and I'm gonna do all I can to stop him. Ricky? You can lock your doors and bolt your windows, but the evil is out there. The evil is out there. <laughs> 